Hello everybody, welcome to uh, Ziggy Plays Catacomb Kids. This is a game that just entered early access in Steam. I do believe it was a Kickstarter game. Um, it is early access, so expect bugs and stuff like that, but this is the first time I've played it. What? Yeah, so you're gonna see me mess up really, really bad and not do great. So that's what's gonna happen. I don't know how the game controls, I haven't played it at all yet. This is like my first intro into it, but I have seen people play it. I've been watching... Uh, I watched Northern Lions, uh, what is it called? Northern Lions, uh, Let's Look At, and I watched, uh, Rockley Smiles Indie Impressions video of this, and I immediately knew it was a game that I was gonna like, or I, I know it's the kind of game I like. It's a roguelike, I play a ton of roguelikes, I'm super excited to play this one. Um, this is kind of, how would I, how would I talk, oh, let's just jump into it, and then I'll just talk about it as it goes. Also, the music is awesome. Oh, it's tutorial, perfect. Alright, let me cough real quick. <clears throat> Alright, let's just jump in. Never seen Would You Like a Tutorial? Yeah, let's get the tutorial going. <coughs> so I'm using an, uh, an Xbox 360 controller here. Um, it's telling me left, right, left, right. So we can just move around. Alright. Okay, so there's no fall damage. I like that that's kind of something they teach you right away. Another unfortunate soul, well, I may as well show you the ropes. Maybe you'll fare better than I did. All right, it's the ghost of a buddy. So we can run, jump, jump up through these wooden platforms. B is to open doors. Down and left trigger to drop through wooden bridges. Okay, left trigger is also to roll. Switches control many things, set them to flip the monitor off. All right, sweet. Switches can also be hit from afar. Pick up items to throw them. Cool. Oh, I dropped that rock. Yeah, alright. I'm liking it so far. Jump while crouched, do a high jump. Okay, so this is like Super Mario World stuff. That's cool. Spikes are only dangerous if you land on them. That's very Spelunky esque. I like that. And if you haven't played Spelunky, Spelunky is an awesome game. Double tap, left or right to sprint. Whoa. I'm dead. Alright. I foresee that can, might be a little bit difficult for me. Okay, so we need keys. You must have the key in your hand to open the door. You can learn to roll. <coughs> to evade traps and enemy attacks. Okay, arm severed. What? I'm missing an arm. Shit. Ah. Oh, arm severed again. Hold B while carrying items to use them. Gotcha. My arm is restored. Sweet. I'm really bad at that. Okay, we need to try this a few times, because obviously I'm terrible. Maybe I'm supposed to sprint? Oh, God. Oh, gotcha. I was just doing it wrong. You can just, yeah. Okay, the roll also works to dodge. Some bees require keys to open. Press B, it'll open the door. Cool. Roll and do a high jump. What? That is some next level shit. Oh, I'm on fire. Okay. We're, we're alright. Oh, I'm dead. Where does he start the roll from? How far do I have to be? He like, he was like in the first few frames of that roll. I'm gonna die right here. Yeah. Alright. Okay. That's gonna be hard for me to time, but I think it'll be cool once I get it. Watch out for traps. Oh, I died. Oh, I died again. How was I supposed to see those? Oh, man. Okay, there's some fish in that there chest. Looks like you can't get through here without magic. All right. I don't know if I wanna... Oh, God! Oh, oh no. All right. Man, I can already tell that this series is going to be a lot of me just dying all over the place. Oh! Attack the fish! Ah, get him out of there! Okay, I guess it wants me to go back to another area. Oh, hey, sword. Occasionally, you have interactable things in the environment. Press up and hold up to use them. Who are you? 
not like that blue fool you've been following around. He's only died last night or last year. In any case, here to help find me again in the catacombs, and I'll teach you a thing or two. Cool. How do I use magic? How do I learn magic? Magic is obtained by learning spells from spell books, which are cost cost learning points. Learning points are acquired by leveling up. Got it. Find a book that is used and use it to equip it, and then learn a spell from the spell book tab on the pause screen. All right. And I guess I use. I can figure it out. All right. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. Sweet. So there is our level up orb. So you get one on every floor. You can use it. I'll level up. Plus one to max attack power. We should get some some of that. Hold attack, charge up power strike. Spell charges plus one max energy. So let's do focus strike just to see how it works. Cool, so there's like little passive skills. One on every floor. Oh, Jesus. Alright, we're alive. We're living. Don't worry about it. Oh, God. Got it. Cool. Oh, forgot about those spikes. That really hurt. Um, so, it doesn't <laughs> look like I have a... Can, can I use... I don't have a key. I'm guessing the key's in there. Gotta attack these fish. Which are just gonna murder me. Unfortunately, they're forgiving me. It's a tutorial. All right, so. Oh God, fish is still alive. All right. Is there a key in here? Grass for air. Where's my? It's a new weapon. Damage. Speed minus. Oh, okay. So. This is just a stick. It's like a harpoon. It's got some range, but other than that, I'm not too enthralled. I gotta learn magic. Kid, you're just a kid. There's nothing I can tell you. Not special. I don't have a spell book. I imagine that's a spell book up there. Um, where am I supposed to go? Hmm. Like I feel like I should be getting a key somewhere. Can't jump around over here. This is just like me to get stuck in a tutorial. Did we already press that lever? I don't think we did. Oh, I died. I died again. Please, please forgive me, everybody. Please forgive me. Oh, I died. All right. I was bad at these puzzles back in Mega Man 2. Oh, whoa, okay, we're good. There's the key. Okay, I knew it had to be somewhere. We're good. Roll! Roll! Jump! Oh, God. This is nerve-wracking. Alright. Got the key. With the key, we can open this door. What the? The key, we can open this door. Then we can get our spell book. Fire and ice. Huh, <laughs> the book of fire and ice. I like it. I think it might be a Game of Thrones reference, but who knows. Alright, down here is our magic book. So we can learn Flame Wave, Infirmus, briefly just a small area of the mirrored location in the Plane of Fire, Ice, let's do Frost Bolt. Okay, Frost Bolt learned. Left bumper is to use it, you have five charges. Cool. Oh, I get it, so there was multiple ways for me to get across that, but when I use the ice when it froze the water, I can use it as a platform. Stomping on enemies makes it easier for an executive, executive attack. Alright. Slime ball. Ooh. Okay, we can just crawl through here. Gear is equipped. As soon as you pick it up, you can only equip one of each equipment type at a time. Alright. So, I think I'm supposed to use the slime ball here. And then climb up there. Yeah. I've got it. Figured it out. I've seen that happen. I Like, I've... I've seen people do that, so I knew that that was something I could do. Boots. No difference, but they make, they're make they not purple. So, I'm going to keep the boots that I have. Thank you very much. Whoa. Whoa. Dick. Bag. Freeze your shit. Got his key. Get your frozen corpse out of here. Press the B button, we're gonna keep going. Large items like chests and corpses can't be stoned away, but corpses can be looted with Y while holding them. Oh. 
Smooth stick, strength down, speed one. More shitty shoes. Cool. He just like slides across the ground. You ain't a poet, dummy. Okay, and this is the exit, and just hold up to leave. Cool, so that was the tutorial, and that'll probably be the first episode. Though, well, actually, let's see how long that, that was, because if it wasn't very long... Yeah, I mean, that's a good enough short episode. I'll be back. We'll probably upload this along with another episode that actually has me playing a level, but that's Catacomb Kids. I'm really, really excited. Um, enjoy this outro music, because it's badass.